Hello everyone, this is Roxas1359. Welcome to my newest Let's Play of Kingdom Hearts Re-Chain of Memories. Kingdom Hearts Chain of Memories was created and developed by Square Enix and Disney Interactive Studios, originally released in 2004 for the Game Boy Advance. In 2007, it was ported over to the PlayStation 2 and was actually bundled with Kingdom Hearts 2 Final Mix Plus. And then in 2008, it was localized for the US, never seeing a release date in Europe. Now, in 2013, for the Kingdom Hearts HD 1.5 Remix, there is a copy of Kingdom Hearts Rechain of Memories HD on the game. So, first question's already raised. Why am I playing the PS2 version when I do have Kingdom Hearts HD 1.5 Remix? The reason is, I don't want to translate again until I probably have to, in which case that's probably going to be Birth by Sleep Final Mix but that's for a later date. I don't want to have to translate it because I have an English copy of the game. I purchased the English copy of the game specifically so then I knew I would be Let's Playing it. Because right now, I own four copies of Kingdom Hearts Chain of Memories. Gonna end up being five probably pretty soon. I have the original Game Boy Advance cartridge. I have this copy I have the copy that I got when I bought Kingdom Hearts 2 Final Mix Plus, because I actually got Final Mix Plus back when it first came out. So I've had that game for a while now. And I have my copy on the Kingdom Hearts HD 1.5 Remix. So four copies, gonna be five because I'm gonna end up getting the Kingdom Hearts HD 1.5 Remix for America to help out with certain things for what I'm doing for another project. So. I'm going to be doing the PS2 version of the game just to save me time with editing and uploading. So the next question is going to be this. How am I going to be doing the game? There are no gummy ships in this game particularly, so I can technically do it 100%. I'm not guaranteeing that I do Kingdom Hearts Rechain of Memories 100%, because personally I've never actually 100%ed Kingdom Hearts Chain of Memories at all. So that's why I'm not guaranteeing it's going to be 100%. It's going to be running through the story for sure. And both stories is what I mean. Because there are two stories in Kingdom Hearts Chain of Memories. I will be playing through both of them, so no worries at all. So how is it going to be uploaded? I'm going to be doing somewhat with what I did for Ratchet & Clank before, and it's going to be every other day. The reason for this is I begin college on August 26th. I want to get a huge bulk of this done so then I can upload it and then not have to worry and have it be on a scheduled upload. And the reason for this is because just like my first semester, and ironically last year when I first was doing Kingdom Hearts Final Mix, I was beginning college and just like last year, I have to go to classes all five days of the week. Staying the latest on three of the days till four o'clock. So then when I get home, I have to do homework and then I go to work in the morning. So you can see I'm going to have a busy schedule. That's why I want to load these up in bulk right now. Now one problem I know I'm going to run into, especially with the timing of this. Kingdom Hearts HD 1.5 Remix in North America comes out on September 10th. It comes out on the 12th in Australia and it comes out on the 13th in Europe. So this is going to be a problem in which Square Enix is probably going to do a massive sweep of things for videos. And I'm not surprised if they do that. They did that originally when 1.5 first came out back in March actually. If you remember what happened to my episode 1. So I'm going to have to do things to avoid copyright. For one of them, it has to deal with Simple and Clean. Simple and Clean in this game plays when you hit a new game. So what I'm going to end up doing is I'm either going to get somebody to see if I can find a remix of it and try and get their permission to use the remix and put it over there, or I'm going to mute it much like how I did in Kingdom Hearts. Final Mix. A lot of people are not going to like that. That is out of my control. EMI Studios Japan has a contract with Yutada Hikaru. I can't control that and 
I can't fall under fair use for the Let's Play unless I mute the track. Otherwise, I'm going to get content ID match, and they're going to mute the entire audio of the track, and I'm going to end up getting a copyright strike if I don't take it down. So you can see the conundrum that I'm put into. That's why I will possibly be muting it if I cannot find a remix that goes with it and a remix that the person who made it will allow me to use. I already have a person in mind. It's the same person I use for all my remixes, so it would make sense, and I like using his music. So that's the main thing for this. What difficulty am I going to be playing it on? Let me show you. As you can see, there is beginner, standard, and proud mode. The enemies are tough in this mode for players who want a thrilling battles. Standard, the difficulty is well balanced in this mode, recommended for first time players of the game. And beginner mode, this is an easy mode where enemies are weak, recommended for inexperienced players. Yeah, beginner mode can always go die for me. So for me, this is between standard and proud, and I can't believe I'm gonna do this, but I'm gonna leave it up to you guys to decide what do I do for the project. Do I do standard or proud mode? Now I'm doing this a lot earlier than how I did for Kingdom Hearts Final Mix because I actually recorded all of that stuff in bulk in a matter of days. Probably like a day and a half in which I had to translate, edit, render everything just to keep up with it, just so that I would not be in trouble. I'm starting about two or three weeks early on this one. So I'm going to have you guys decide, do I do standard mode or proud mode on this one? I don't know if it's going to be a 100% run or not. That's why I'm saying this now. But vote in the comments on whether you want it standard or proud mode. Something's telling me I already know what mode it's going to be. So anyway, guys, I'm going to end it off right here. The project's not going to premiere for a while. I'm probably going to set the project to premiere when I begin college, as I will more than likely have the episodes uploaded and run through on that. It's not going to be running through weekends because I need this one to last me. And I want to try and see if I can finish this one faster than how I did the first Kingdom Hearts Final Mix. So anyway, this has been Roxas1359, and I'll see you guys when this project begins. So, vote away in the comments on whether you want me to do proud mode or standard mode. I think I already know what the winner's going to be. Bye-bye.